Charles and Julian, today on your wedding day, as you promise to love each other forever, you are holding the hands of your best friend. These are the hands that will work alongside yours as together you build your future. These are the hands that will love and cherish you through the years. These are the hands that will celebrate with you when you feel happy and comfort you when you feel sad. These are the hands that will give you strength and support when you need it. And as your hands are joined together now, so you may your hearts always be. This is the story of how Charlotte met you. And I promise you now, every word of this is true. Let me start off this poem by describing the scene. I'm in bed in Dubai and I'm having a dream. The date is before Dan and Scal's big weekend. At this point in time, we're just Facebook friends. As I sleep, I'm hit by an energy flow. Whether such things are possible, we'll never really know. In my brain is your face and your name, Charlotte Hudders. I wake with a jump, look at my phone and get shudders. One new Facebook notification received. And who this was from? I struggled to believe. But it was you, you tagged me as Puss in Boots. <laughs> and before even knowing you, my feelings grew roots. On Saturday at church, you had your hair and makeup done. You look so beautiful, Charlotte. I knew you the one. We sat next to each other that night at dinner. Angelina Jolie and a six foot four ginger. <laughs> on Sunday, we woke up on the bathroom floor with big smiles, glazed eyes and heads that were sore. On Monday, I stayed for an additional day. I couldn't leave you then. I wanted to stay. Charlotte, falling in love with you was just magic. When we said our goodbyes at Glasgow Airport, it was tragic. That weekend, four years ago, changed everything for me. Instead of saying dinner, I now call it tea. <laughs> <laughs> Cece, my wifey, I'm so proud of you. I can't wait to see where our life together leads to. So ladies and gentlemen, will you please charge your glasses and join me in toasting the love of my life to Charlotte Hudders Callanan, my beautiful wife. Julian Callanan. Accept you, Charlotte Hudders. Accept you, Charlotte Hudders. As my lawful wedded wife. As my lawful wedded wife. Charlotte, please repeat after me. I, Charlotte Hudders. I, Charlotte Hudders. Accept you, Julian Callanan. Accept you, Julian Callanan. As my lawfully wedded 
husband. As my lovely wedded husband. Following the declarations which you have both made in my presence and in the presence of all these witnesses, I confirm that you, Julian, and you, Charlotte, are husband and wife and are married. <laughs> may kiss each other now. Cheryl and I have always felt that Charles and Julian were made for each other. And I know it's a bit of a cliche, but we, we've discussed it on many occasions and said, yes, this is, this is right. We completely entrust our very special... Come on, you can do it. Our very special little girl into Julian's care. We are very proud indeed of Charlotte and all that she has achieved. We have always believed that she is as beautiful on the inside as she is on the outside. I know that we're biased, but Cheryl and I feel that we've been blessed with a daughter of very rare qualities, um, very rare indeed, who will make Julian as wonderful a wife as she has made us a daughter. On behalf of Cheryl and myself, we wish you both the very, very best of health and happiness. Ladies and gents, please, Grab your glasses, rise, so that we can wish them both the very best of health and happiness to Charlotte and Judy for the future. Charlotte, you are beautiful inside and out. You're slow to anger and quick to smile. You are unbelievably artistically talented. You are determined and laid back in just the right way. You have an amazing ability to turn anyone you meet into your friend. And I don't know how a guy like me could marry a girl like you, but I'm chuffed to bits that I have. And now it's legally binding. <laughs>